Hey guys, it's uh, Lee. April 27th, 26 p.m. I, uh, I know it's been a while since I posted on this channel. Things have just been really hectic with work and finals coming up. But, um, about a week ago, I, uh, I finally got some time to myself. And I finally went up to the location that was posted in that, um, in that video, those coordinates that I was given. And, um, mind you, those coordinates were the same coordinates written down in the diary we found in Caitlin's shed. And so, I followed them. And... Things didn't go so well. So I went there and I hoped I could find someone. There was there was no one there. Hello? I was about to leave and I started hearing a noise. It sounded like it was coming from inside the bridge. And um, I followed it. And it took a while to get up top. I just had to go through a whole bunch of paths back like through the woods to get there but I got up I got up to the top and I found, found a rail car with this symbol drawn on it. It was old, I couldn't tell how old, but it had been there for a while. And so I started walking down the path. And this is what happened. I don't know what you're talking about. I don't know what you're talking about. I swear to God, I don't know. Oh, fuck! Tell me where it is! I'm done with the game. Okay, okay, shit, shit. All right, it's in the bag. It's in the bag. It's, it's, in, it's in my bag. Go, just go. It's in my bag. I can't find it. What's going on? Go. Who are you? Go! Who the f Go! Don't worry about it. Just go! And I, after that, I just kept running. I managed to find a way down and then across back to my car and I drove out of there. I don't... I don't know who that person was. I don't know why she saved me, but I mean, if she's still alive, I owe her my life. And 
what I did manage to get out of it is this. I don't... <laughs> I don't know what it is. I don't even really want to open it. This whole thing just got really... Just this whole thing got too real for me. And I'm really scared.